This video is about getting outside with your cell phone. And if you are like me, you normally have it in your pocket, but you want a more creative way to record some content, maybe charge your cell phone on the way there in the car, maybe charge your cell phone on the motorcycle on the way there. Peak Design has you covered. They have a whole range of accessories. They just released the charging stuff for the motorcycle, so I wanted to check it out. This video is partially sponsored by Peak Design because they sent me a range of accessories to test out. And now the thrust of it is this case. They have your cell phone covered. This is an iPhone. This is the 16 Max Pro that uh, has its case. So it's an everyday case, has a slim link, which attaches to everything. Let's get into the accessories. It is one of the most comprehensive ecosystems for your cell phone to get outside with. So let's get to it. So yeah, so I do think this Peak Design ecosystem is the most comprehensive way to get you outside with your cell phone as your primary photo and video recording device. So, you know, hiking, perfect. They have this very awesome mobile creator kit, which is essentially just this little mount, which includes not only the locking plate and this base plate, which will attach to tripods, the quick capture system, whatever you're going to do, but it also is the standard GoPro mount. So if you wanted to attach it to just about anything else, you have that ability. So cool, right? I, and again, this is, I think, the most comprehensive way. This is an example of backpack mode, easily transportable to a tripod and that kind of thing, just to record stuff with your cell phone, mobily, mobily. Anyway, this whole system starts with the case though, and the slim link design is fantastic. Now I normally, at least recently, have been going no case whatsoever on my phone, but the problem is I can't attach it to anything in the car, on the motorcycle, on the bicycle, so I need a, some sort of case. Now I've used previous designs from other manufacturers before, namely Quadlock, this one from Peak Design was appealing mostly because of the Slimlink system. Now it's totally different. And what really got me into the Peak Design thing was they came out with a whole bunch of wireless charging QI2 chargers for the motorcycle and of course for the car. And I wanted to dive into that, more about that in a little bit. But the case itself, I do think feels slimmer than other designs. And it has the cutouts, everything for the newest iPhone and this is the everyday case for Peak Design. It also has a very ingenious little, little attachment points on the bottom of the case that allows you to use their quick capture little dongle things to really attach this to anything. Now you could put two of them on here and use a camera strap and just carry your cell phone around like that, which is pretty cool. They have a whole range of different thicknesses of their camera strap, which you could use for your cell phone, which is nice. And again, two little anchor points for that. I've, since I put this on there a couple days ago, I've just been continuing to just use it as a just nice quick and grab thing for my cell phone out of my pocket. So I'm not sure how long I'm gonna leave it on there, but it's there for now. The other thing that I love about this with the case is the fact that you can get this little attachment cord, everyday little attachment thing i can't remember the technical name for it i'll put it down below but it has a quick capture thing and it's stretchy and a little loop so you can loop this through and attach it to just about anything so skiing um, i will probably use this when i'm cycling because i like to just put this in my side little pocket on my shorts pull this out take a photo put it back I'm sometimes worried about dropping this and losing the cell phone now that I have a way to attach it so that is just one way you can use this attachment it's only ten dollars at peak design link in the description so there you go case mobile accessories very friendly for all those things gear to get you outside now they also have cycling attachments which I haven't used because I normally carry this in my pocket and I have a Garmin device on my both my mountain bike and my road bike so but you could do it that way but the motorcycle was the other thing that i was really excited for 
Now on the motorcycle, they have uh, several different mounts. All of them have the same vibration dampening in built in and they have either charging or non-charging mounts. Now on a motorcycle, I think that the only way to go is the charging mount. Why? Because it's in full brightness. It's blaring out at you. It's using the GPS to navigate. You probably want it to be charged when you get to your destination and you're maybe navigating in the woods or whatever. So you want to be charging on your motorcycle. Your motorcycle design is gonna vary based off of the charging, USB charging, or maybe a, an aftermarket way to charge it. However, on my Triumph Street Twin, there is a USB-A connection point by the battery. So I can connect a USB-A cord, run it out. Now, here is a bummer. Included in the box is not a USB-A. It is a USB-C to their proprietary connection cord. Now, the quad lock one is, is the one I have is A to C into the mount. So I can't just use that charging cord plug it into the Peak Design and go. I have to rewire, reroute the cable to the charging point. Now I have the handlebar mount, which attaches to the handlebar and gets uh, mounted in different locations. Kind of a bummer that I can't get it exactly in the middle on the Triumph, but that's just unique to my motorcycle. The quad lock one I had before was also very similar, it has a different attachment head but it is vibration dampening, which is an accessory you have to add to that. Kind of a bummer. But either way, both of them are similar in that style and then they connect to the handlebar. This is the ball mount. The ball mount will connect to and right on my motorcycle right now. I have an action camera there, but I can remove that action camera mount and put this ball mount in there and it has the same proprietary cord that would attach. So again, did I mention that the USB-A to mount is only i think it's twenty dollars but it's available at peak design either way both mounts are very similar in that they're square head but it matches with the slim link you can either go vertical or you can go horizontal depending on how you are using it in the specific location i will navigate this way most of the time i hardly ever ride with it in the vertical mode so I kind of keep it on the side. Either way, little two little buttons on either side of the mount to release the link system so that you can get your phone off of there. So magnetically attached, I would just give it a little tug because with the magnets, you may have a tendency to just have it on there. You think it's attached, but it's really not. So give it a nice little tug or wait for the click. Of course, if your motorcycle is running, you just want to make sure it's attached click and it's attached. So there you go. Ball mount. You may need the ball mount. The ball mount advantage is that it can be used in really any sort of mode using third party accessories that are really the standard one inch ball mount to aviation or um, on the water on your boat or you just kind of name it. There's any way to mount this thing using the ball mount. So that's really, really helpful. Universal again, charging QI2, locking, just fantastic. Again, USB-C cord included. So that's motorcycle. Handlebar mount is really the way to go. They, although they have different stem mounts and brake lever mounts all available, just like other people, but the Peak Design stuff is comprehensive. And again, charging or non-charging. Some other little accessories to complete your mobile ecosystem. One is just charging it either on your desk or while traveling is this Peak Design and now do they call it, it is just a charging stand. It's not travel, but it does compress to something very small. It's kind of heavy. It's definitely nice and weighted for it to keep your cell phone in the right location whenever you put it there. I'm gonna travel with this a little bit, mostly because I am addicted to having my phone in this nightstand mode. So if you haven't tried the iPhones this way, if you set it up, it looks like a clock and you can see your alarm and all that stuff so it's very very handy so we'll uh, try to change and this just has a USB-C attachment in the back or plug so your standard USB-C cord you already have will work for that the last little tip I have 
which is very, very handy. I think this on the backpack, this creator kit is really, really awesome and useful. The other thing they came out with is this little stand, phone stand, which this is the same size as a wallet, but which they also have, which I don't, I don't use, but they have this little kickstand thing, which attaches magnetically to your phone. This will work without this case, to be honest. It'll work with any, uh, yeah, without your, with any magnetic case or the phone without a case. And it just has these little legs that kick out and will let you stand your phone in different locations. So you can move it around, use it for a tripod for your camera, take the little selfies while it's on a rock, or just watch a movie in the airplane at your desk while you're having a meal, whatever you wanted to do, or watch your favorite YouTube videos from JB Outside or JB on Tech, because it just is very, very handy and portable and really seamlessly just hides away when it's nice and compressed. So there you go, keep it with you wherever you go. I have an alternative, this is a Moft little kickstand which I've been using for a little bit. It's also very slim and you know, it's pretty cool. Link in the description of that one if you wanna check that out, it's just on Amazon, but both are really cool. And I just kinda of like this one. What's cool about the Peak Design though, is there's these little tiny screws to tighten this up. So let's say you had it, it was starting to loosen it up for whatever reason, or you really wanted to lock it down in a single position. They include this little tiny tool, magnetically attached, put it in there. Ta -da. It's awesome. So there you go. I love that thing. So there you go. That is the ecosystem from Peak Design. Super cool, super useful. And I, like I said, the most comprehensive way to carry your cell phone wherever you happen to be. And creator mode, if you wanna record stuff while you're on the trail, travel, it's just, you know, again, most comprehensive and very useful if you're already into the Peak Design sort of way of life ecosystem with like the quick capture for your backpack, um, tripods, that kind of thing. It's just very, very useful. So there you go. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. More coming soon. Probably a backpack of some sort. I got a lot on the way. Some already here. Some I can't wait to tell you about because I've already filmed it and it's sitting, waiting to go. So with that, get outside, enjoy it. See ya. What if I told you I found a fantastic way to integrate, will allow you to... What if I told you I found a fantastic... What if I told you I found a fantastic... They didn't really want me to compare it to quad lock, but I did anyway, and I will. In this video, we're gonna talk about...